there, it's Amy at Birds in the Doghouse. One of the most popular questions that I always get is what do you put in chop? How do you make it? What do they like? What do they not like? What is good for them? What's not good for them? So we put together a couple of videos for you of the actual chop that our birds receive and hope this will help a lot. Just let me know if you have any questions. Reach out. Thanks. This morning, this is what's going to be in our chop. And there are a lot of goodies in here. Uh, the vegetables outweigh the fruits, but the fruits I do have are less sugar. Like, I don't have bananas in here. Um, I do have a little apple, so that's probably my highest sugar. But if it's in the middle of mating season and you don't want to promote breeding behavior, then cut your sugars down and make sure your veggies are predominantly what you're feeding. So we've got a jalapeno, or a jalapeno right here. We have a habanero right here. It doesn't matter how hot the pepper, the birds love the hotter the better. We've got broccoli, we have a regular pepper here. Um, I do have a couple females, so this time of year I like to boost the calcium a little bit, so I will hard boil that egg, and I'll chop it up in there, and they love it. I've got strawberries, I have spinach. I have um, some broccoli slaw, which actually is kind of a cheat, but it's got cabbage in it, it's got carrots in it, and it, it's a nice little filler. I've got raspberries, blackberries, snow peas, green beans, there's my apple again, kale, uh, pomegranate, they love the pomegranate, so when I chop that up, I'm gonna leave it in two sections so they can they can play with that and try to get the seeds out of there. They, they like to do that, strawberry. I think that's pretty much it for this morning. So I'm gonna chop that into small pieces for him. And I'll have one big, huge community bowl. I take it out in the afternoon because I don't want my fruits to spoil. And you'll notice the water. That's because I have really thoroughly washed all of these ingredients. That's extremely important. You don't want pesticides on your fruit and veggies. And even if it says that it's organic, I still don't trust it. Just rinse it off. You never know where it came from. And you don't know what was in the middle of transport. So that would be my chop for the morning. We have five ringnecks, two plum heads, and four Hagoromo helicopter budgies who are all weaned and eating chop. And then we have eight ringneck babies and two Tine African gray babies that will be eating chop like this within the next few weeks to wean them. So we just wanted to show you a little bit about um, what we do and how we do it. And this is a daily occurrence. Our birds are very happy and healthy. The first thing you wanna do, never, never give them rotten food. You can kill a bird with that. And please make sure you thoroughly wash your veggies. So I have handpicked and looked at every single piece on this board to make sure that it's fresh and healthy. We have cucumbers, we have cauliflower, we have apples, we have bean sprouts, we have red and yellow peppers, we have habanero peppers, we have broccoli, sweet corn, celery, parsley, Brussels sprouts, spinach, blueberries, blackberries, raspberries, there's our Bird Street Bistro cool enough. Make sure it's cold before you put it in with, with cold fruit. Then we have a little slaw mix. It's just a nice little cheap filler. What we're gonna do, we're gonna chop it all up like I've been doing over here. And this is just a two day supply. I will not let fruits and veggies go more than two days. You don't want them to start spoiling. If one thing spoils, it spreads to everything else. Um, adding Bird Street Bistro is wonderful. You'll see all of these flavors over here. It just gives them a variety. I mean, we're gonna do a taste test with all of these here pretty soon because we've got some new flavors in, but we have not gone wrong with any single one in there. Even the little budgies love it. So um, this is what's going on in the chopping block today.